Hey guys, Caleb Brown, New Planner Recruiting here. Hope everybody is doing well. Hey, great to see you. Hope you had a fabulous weekend and got to watch some of the Olympics. Hey, last week I was talking with one of my clients and they were, they were just sort of, not lamenting, but just mentioning the fact that their new planner that we help them hire and they have in their office is, who's got a couple years of experience, so not someone fresh out of college, but just talking about how they don't ever seem to ask any questions and they're doing things and they're making decisions and it, it just seemed more normal to the senior planner that they would come and ask questions before just sort of launching in and giving advice or going a certain direction or doing things. So I just was, was thinking about this and we hear this a lot too. So I just thinking about like maybe if you're, if you're a job seeker out there, signs that you aren't growing. All right, if, you, if you're in a firm and you're, you think you know everything and you're like, man, I don't need these people. I mean, you need to be asking questions, all right? especially if you're, if you're newer. Even people, I mean, the people at the, the, you know, the highly experienced people that have been doing this for decades still go to mentors and ask questions and do research and they don't know everything about everything. So that's not a good sign if you're at a firm and you never go ask your boss anything about how to handle something or even, you know, maybe not your supervisor, but someone else that you, that you work with. So uh, you're, you need to be asking lots of questions if you're a new planner, okay? The second thing, if you're not being challenged and you're not having to research things or practice certain things or, or prepare for difficult conversations, I mean, you, you're, you're not growing. You need, to be, you need to be pushed out of your comfort zone, which is what we've talked about a lot on this, on this show. And then I think if just, and this could maybe be a, a more applicable to people who just work with a very hyper niche, like we only work with executives at 3M and they just, they see the same thing over and over and over and over and over and over again. I mean, you, you need to have a little variety, right? I mean, if you're, if you're caught in a rut and you're not, go over here and do some pro bono stuff for a completely different type of clientele or, or accept another type of client that even though they may not fit your niche because People can get burned out doing that and you need a variety of work to making sure you're constantly being pushed and challenges. So ask lots of questions, variety of work, being pushed and challenging yourself to achieve more than you think you're capable of. I hope that was helpful. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.